In this video, I will share with you 3 steps to renew your motorcycle in less than 30 minutes. Trust me, you gonna thank me later. Tanawa ni nga video and this will really help you a lot. I only paid 1,200 pesos and na-renew na akong motor in a very convenient and fast way via the LTO online platform. The very first requirement is dapat registrado na yung vehicle sa LTMS portal same sa ako. Ah, disclaimer lang, these steps nga akong i-share ninyo is based in my personal experience ha Step 1. Get your motorcycle and insurance. In my case, anhi ko sa M. Luwilier kay Baratora. I only paid 297 pesos for this and dali ragyud kaayo. Step 2. Go to the nearest private motor vehicle inspection center nga accredited sa LTO and have your motorcycle checked. In my case, ari ko sa Pink Gorilla sa Barangay Alang Alang Mandawe kay nasuki na yud ko diri. I-flex na ako kadayot akong spider helmet kay murag guwapo sa yud I paid 650 pesos dari including sa stencil. If nagtifid ka, pwede pag ani ikaw na lang mo stencil and you will save 50 pesos. Ang ganahan lang yun ako dari kay paspas. After payment, naghulat lang kung 5 minutes, ako na day motor ang git test. What they will do here is check the brakes, emission test, and all. Ah, basta it's all about safety ni ilang gibuhat nga procedures and automated na kaayo ni. Step 3. After ni mo makuha ang result, go to the LTO portal, log in, and go to your profile, click vehicle o sa nakita ninyo, need na ni i-renew akong motor. Click renew online, input the necessary reference numbers, and click validate. After that, it will redirect you to the payment section. Kung mo pili ra ka asa ka pwede mo bayad iha. After payment, it will direct you to the portal again and voila! Naanay mong official receipt. So just download it, save sa phone, and have it printed. So mao na to, I paid a total of 1,208 pesos o green yun na akong motor in less than 30 minutes. Share this video para daghan tag matabangan to avoid fixers and to maximize the online platform sa LTO. Diri na lang ni Kutub, bye bye